All right, let's go on. Describe an important thing you learned, not at school or college. Well, I have learned a lot of things at school, but here I'd like to talk about uh, one skill which I have learned at home. It was in 2021. Uh, there was corona pandemic, so I was free at home. So I have decided to learn something new. So I decided to learn cooking. So because at that time I was free, so I want to use my time productively. And another, I, another thing was that, was that I was also planning to go abroad, so it will be helpful for me to learn cooking. So first of all, I st started videos from YouTube uh, and learned the basics of cooking. After that, uh, I was helped by my mother and uh, I, th I learned a lot up from him. Uh, it was my hard work in persistent which paired up and uh, I became an expert in six months. Uh, after that, uh, I feel very ecstatic because it was something that uh, not everyone can learn easily. So my life became easy after that and uh, I have also learned about the nutritional values of various foods and cooking. Okay, that's good. One minute, 21 seconds. Overall, it's good, but there are some mistakes in the use of pronoun for male, female, like him or her. Okay, and then there are some mistakes in the use of tenses. You said, I feel. It should have been, I felt. So present and past. Because your cue card is important skill you learned. Everything should be in the past tense, second form of the verb, okay? That's what you need to do, right? Okay, thank you. All right, let's move on. IELTS speaking part two. Describe something that surprised you and made you happy. Yes. Uh, well, uh, today I would like to uh, tell you about my surprising moment in my life. You, you know, everyone have a, a couple of surprising moments in their life. Uh, but some moments, you know, uh, you can't forget in your whole life, you know, because it is special for you. And uh, uh, that's happened to me as same. So it is like uh, uh, in the morning of uh, uh, 21 November 2021, that happened with me once I came to office as usual. Uh, so I see the newspaper. I saw. I saw newspaper. And uh, surprisingly, that newspaper contained my picture and uh, that design made by myself. And uh, that is very surprising moment for me. That was. That was very surprising moment for me. Uh, you know, uh, uh, I just started my career in before three months ago. Uh, I was very youngest uh, designer in that company. Uh, so uh, it's very uh, like it's achievement for myself. It was a great achievement for me. Yeah, it was a great achievement for me. Uh, you know, uh, all of the staff are uh, elder from me and I was the youngest. Uh, and the uh, most uh, happy moment for me is that uh, because uh, on that day, our main staff is uh, on leave. And, uh, you know, it's uh, COVID. Uh, some clients are on uh, suffering COVID okay. disease. Okay, thank you. One minute, 35 seconds. Overall good. You're mixing present and past. All the staff uh, is on leave. The staff, they were on leave. Then you said uh, elder than me. It should be older than me, right? Not elder. But overall it's good. Okay, let's go on. Describe a photo that you took and are proud of. Yes, please. I take photo on vending functions, party functions, and I take photo. I prefer take photo when I go outside uh, with family. Uh, last month, I go. K I went. I went K2. Uh, I took a photo of mountain, and I took photo with parents and other family person uh, the photo of, about nature and memorable uh, when I see photo when I saw when I saw photo uh, 
I feel very good. Okay, when I see this photo, I feel very good. I feel very well, okay? That's it. Okay, it's 50 second answer only. So try to speak more, okay? Now practice five cue cards every day and record your voice and then listen to it and enjoy. Okay, yeah, good job. Okay, let's move ahead. Describe a problem you had while shopping online or in store. Last weekend on a holiday, uh, uh, last, it, it was a last weekend uh, and it was a holiday, so I was scrolling my phone. So uh, uh, suddenly an uh, advertisement was pop up. So it was very attractive for me. It was related to shoes. So when I opened that uh, page, so the first page was very good and uh, attractive for me. There were plenty of shoes uh, and uh, uh, the, uh, the, there are different quality of <laughs> shoes also. So I would decide to buy some uh, some shoes. So uh, uh, so first I face a problem that was uh, what type of shoes I'll buy. So uh, I select a shoes which I was, selected. I selected a shoes uh, that was uh, very good and shiny. So uh, I uh, registered that uh, shoes. So the the problem I also faced that the time limit uh, was very. Uh, different uh, the limit was for a week so after a week uh, i was very excited up uh, 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 that that parcel was came to me to, uh, so when uh, i after paying the the bill when i opened the that sh uh, shoe box so the first uh, the first expression was ex uh, was very different f uh, for me because it was not that which was look on the uh, the page uh, which I saw, saw on their page or on which I had page, seen yes. on their page so right. uh, so I it was also uh, an issue that I faced that was a, also a size problem okay thank you so much just try to summarize your ideas because it's 137 and you have not reached the conclusion of your topic okay yes, but overall it's good and uh, just try to improve your pronunciation that will further improve your bench score good job okay Uh, just allow me a few seconds and then we continue. All right, describe an exciting activity that you experienced with someone else. Yes, please. Yes. Thank you. Uh, exciting activity, yes. Uh, this was very exciting to me. That was swimming. And uh, why exciting to me? That's because I could not uh, do swimming. I was not a experience of that. And it was with my colleagues and my family. And uh, now I will let you know about the tale history of this. Uh, two, three years ago when I was in Bangladesh, at that moment I had decided that I would not go to Pakistan at that moment. So I should stay in Bangladesh to spend holidays. That's why we have decided to go in any recreational areas and selected in a five-star hotels where different kind of activities would be performed that set. At that moment, we had selected, we have in detail, we uh, search out and we checked uh, a Grand Sultan outside of the Bangladesh, that's why. Uh, not in outside Bangladesh, but at the outside of the Bangladesh. At that moment, we went away and um, uh, I remember that on the second day when we reached here and there was different kind of activities were here and one activity uh, was uh, swimming and with the children. I was in my room and uh, my uh, uh, colleagues called me that please come down and we have to uh, play with the children. At that moment, okay, what we have to do, they decided that we have to do some swimming with them. Uh, okay, uh, I decided and I should go with my ch child. When I joined and I realized that I could not do this. And uh, he called me to help my son. And after that, they helped me a lot and they took me from that swimming pool. And it was exciting, it was very experienced. Uh, after that, I had learned a lot about, about this and I had done a lot of different things. Okay, exercises. that's good. One minute, 40 seconds. Overall, you spoke well. You're speaking very frankly, comfortably, fluency is there. There are minor mistakes, but overall, it's very good. <clears throat> good job.